Hey everyone, it's Jason. Um, so this came out, this is something a little bit different, uh, but still in line with the other videos I do. It's part of the world's smallest, uh, collections. So, if you're not familiar with the world's smallest, it's where they make miniature versions of classic toys. Uh, getting like Barbies, Hot Wheels, you know, Stretch Armstrongs, pretty much anything. Um, and they made this, just came out not terribly long ago, or Magic the Gathering cards. I mean, obviously they're off of like a newer set, but they're still pretty, pretty interesting. Um, and I just realized this isn't just gonna pop open. Good thing I got me some scissors. So I'm a, uh, I'm not gonna say a huge Magic the Gathering fan. I like Magic. I played it for quite a few years. Um, as you've seen, you probably seen I have video on here of uh, some unboxing of cards. Um, I mean, I'm not like hardcore on it anymore. Most of that's because it's hard to find people around to play. Um, but I couldn't resist picking these up because, you know, they're interesting. So I wanted to just kind of go through an unboxing. So we have a Jace and a Varaska deck. So we have a blue Island Jace deck. And we have a green, black, Varaska deck. Now, I kind of wish they made, like, another pack. Like, red and white. Just so you could have, you know, all four colors. But, that's just me. Oh my gosh. And then, even as I open them, they're wrapped inside, too. So, they're... Supposed to be 100% playable decks, which, you know, seeing that they're, they made the cards this small, there's no reason why they couldn't have made them, you know, viable decks. I mean, they could have got off cheap and just made, like, them in the box, and like, oh, look, the smallest box of magic cards, and not actually had any cards. Or they could have made, like, uh, like, one or two cards that fit inside that were, like, printed on, like, hard plastic. But no, these are... On cardboard, I would say pretty much comparable to a magic card. Let's check a magic gathering back. We even have like the watermark here on the uh, deck master. We have Jace, architect of thoughts. Oh boy. I don't want to get that zoomed in well enough to really read. Oh, 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 and we dropped her. Yeah, so that's pretty cool. Uh, it's got its own special little symbol there. And I'm not going to sit here and read all the effects. I mean, if you're that much into magic. Um, go looking good, but yeah, there's the little set symbol. It's kind of like, uh, I'm not sure what that symbol is supposed to be. But two of 88. We have a Chromaton. See if I can maybe kind of go through these a little faster. If I hold do them one at a time, we're gonna be here all day for 60 cards. Jace's Phantasm. The Phantasmal Bear. I love that they made an illusions a thing. Um you know, cheap creatures that die if they're targeted. Uh the other figment. I'm not really a huge blue guy. Uh, Crosstown Courier. A Dream Stalker. Crovian Mist. Another one of those. Seagate Oracle. Stealer of Secrets. Got some drawing card effects. The other adept. Yep, 
the Archromancer. Ar Archaeomancer. I might be pronouncing that. A Phantasmal Dragon. Dragon Illusion, yes. The Body Double. The body Double enters the alpha as a copy of any creature in a graveyard. Nice. Uh, the Leyline Phantom. The Aeon Chronicler. Oh, dude, this has Suspend. I like that mechanic, too. Um, where you can pay a specific amount and then it comes in at that many counters. Whenever a time counter is removed from Aeon Crackle, it's just awesome. Draw a card. Nice. Basically, it's a card drawer every turn as long as you, the longer you have it sitting out. Uh, the Rift Rift Wing Cloud Skate. Jason's Mind Seeker. Got a bunch more illusions in here than I thought. Uh, the Errant Ephraimon. Also, let's suspend. Jason's Ingenuity. Summoner's Bane. Oh, we got more. That's all I could hold at one time. Array of Command. Griptide, Remand, Prohibit, Memory Lapse, we like some old artwork, Into the Royal, or Into the Roll, uh, Thought Scour, two of those, I haven't seen too many duplicates, which is pretty cool. Um, you're gonna bother to do this. Make it a, a viable deck, but yeah, not have four of this card, four of that card. Uh, Spell Twine. Merfolk Wayfinder. Argrophobia. Claustrophobia. Oh, I love the enchantments that enchant other players. Um, Control Magic. Enchant creature, you control enchanted creature. Nice. Uh, future sight. We got some lands. We have the Hilarium Halimar, Halimar Depth. A couple of those. Now we're going to start getting into a bunch of duplicates with all the lands. Uh, Dread Statuary. Comes with Golem. Golem. And then a bunch of islands. We have some different artworks. So we have. Oh, they're going to give us five different artworks, it looks like. So we got some waterfalls, overhead city, another city. That one, that looks like we're starting to repeat. Well, let's double check. Oh yeah, look at all these tiny little lands. Alright, so that was Jace's deck. Now let's check Vraska's. So it's green and black. Um, it's cool again, I really wish it would have had white. White is my color. Um, although if they had white, it would have been, uh, most likely in a Johnny-type deck, which would have been soldiers, which is not my archetype. I like my walls. Um, alright, so Vraska the Unseen, who's a Gorgon. We have a Pulse Tracker. Shadow Alley Denizen. Uh, Tavern Swindlers, we're gonna have some Human Road, we're gonna have some Scum, we have some Zombies, uh, Reich of Precinct 6, uh, Death Hood Cobra, 
Looks like we have a little all over the place. There's some snakes. Uh, Gatekeeper Vine, a plank. This is an awesome card. Got two of those. There's some good defenders. Uh, Vine Lasher, Kaguza. Kug, Fuse? Not really sure. Kudzu? Remember Lang, Anchors of Battlefinger, Kill, put a 1 1 Vine. Counter on him. Nice. Uh, Putrid Leech. Zombie Leech. That's neat. Sadistic Augur Mage. Slate Street Ruffian. Oring Reef Recluse. Spawn Wraith. This deck actually looks pretty interesting to me. I like the different stuff. Uh, Stonefair Crocodile. Orthring Viper. Corpse Trader. Fester High Boar. Morbid. Oh, oh, and we dropped them. Luckily, they didn't go off the table. Oh boy, that would have been a fun game of pick me up. Uh, Mold Shambler. I try to look at that symbol a little bit more. A little bit easier to see stuff on the uh, common cards. Uh, Highway Robber. Uh, Nyekatal. Reaper of the Wild. You can already see some of these cards kind of damage on the outside, but I don't think, I think that's unavoidable. Ooh, and that's six slime with Death Touch. Drooling Grudelung. The Hypnotic Cloud. Ooh, with a kicker. Uh, Knight's Whisper. Marsh Casualties. Kicker started in the Invasion set, which is one of my favorite blocks. Um, Treasured Fiend. Tragic Slip. Some more Tragic Slip. Last Kiss. Ooh, ooh. Consume Strength. Grizzly Spectacle. Stab Wound. Underworld Connections. Alright, and we got some land. We have the Golgari, the Golgari Gate, Guild Gate. So it's with the uh, one land, or a uh, plant that we had right away. Rogue's Passage. Makes sense, we have rogues in here. Some Tainted Wood. Like you get some, we're gonna get some special land in this set, of course. Uh, we have a river boa with island walk. Oh boy, that's mean for this other set. That means he gets free damage. And we have some swamps. So we have like the underground swamp. I think lots of this artwork looks like it's probably from one of the Ravnica sets. I mean, I'm not 100% on that. But that's what it kind of looks like. Alright. And that was the swamps. And then now let's look at the forests. A bunch of forests. Alright, that was our world's smallest Magic the Gathering decks. Raska versus Jace. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you liked the Magic the Gathering unboxing stuff, let me know uh, in the comments and I will try and buy more Magic the Gathering cards. I primarily try and focus on uh, board games, things that don't have random packs. Um, but if you guys like watching me open up random packs of Magic cards, you know, I'll definitely make sure I record them when I buy them. Uh, see you guys later. Bye.